Hey guys, it's me Steve again. Welcome to my channel. If you're coming back, if you're here for the first time, welcome. Um, today, I'm actually just going to be doing a random unboxing here for some records that I just recently received. Um, it came from Urban Outfitters and Target and um, I believe Tower Records here. Um, it's just going to be some random records here, but I wanted to show you off, you know, what I had received. So I want to share that with you guys today. I'm just going to open that up here. And the first record we have here is Mac Miller, Good AM, or Good Morning here. Uh, this is an Urban Outfitters exclusive, actually. So um, I definitely want to have that because I'm a really big fan of Mac Miller. So i um, going to go ahead and open that up here. I believe this is supposed to be a exclusive color that's only for uh, Urban Outfitters. So let's check that out. As you can see, there's no track listing on the back or on the front, but on the side, this continuously says good AM and it comes with a little insert here with the album credits on one side, kind of like a little poster, sorry, on the other side here. You are definitely Miss Mac. And, well, and so, these are the records here. Looks like they have them a little backwards. Uh, but go ahead and get that fixed there. There's two LPs. So this color is kind of like a gray silverish, silverish gray color. That's side one, side two. And then the second LP I believe is the same color. Side three, yeah, side four there. All right, and that's Mac Miller. Go ahead and put him back in here. Oh, I'm just put that back this way then. We'll fix that later. Next one here is B Miller. Uh, elated. Uh, she actually had a song Black that I really liked and I was like, you know what, let me check her out. So it was a, I believe this is another uh, Urban Outfitter exclusive. So let's check this out here. I had to go through the outfit in here. Now, one thing also, the song that I did like by Black, uh, the song with her in Black, I don't think it's on this particular uh, album here, but I decided to check it out. So, and I, I like her too. I have some of her previous F, uh, records, not on vinyl, but on, I bought it from iTunes. So, that's side A, side B. Let's just see this back in here. And here's the front cover. Uh, just show that to you guys again. And here's the back with the track listing. And it doesn't look like it comes with any inserts or anything. You know, some of these things, they come with inserts or even digital downloads. Next up here is my leaf. I believe I got this from Tower Records, so. Uh, I've been waiting for this one for a little minute. My re local record store actually ended up selling out of this here, so I didn't get a chance to get it. So I went looking for it online and I was able to find it. Now, I actually am a little surprised at this here. It's got a glossy cover uh, right there, uh, as you can see. And then on the back, we have 
the track listing with the production credits. Now, uh, one of the things on this album is uh, they uh, have production from Havoc, Q-Tip, and others, I believe. Um, one of their biggest songs on this is uh, Shook One, so definitely like that here. And I think this one is just a regular black one here, yeah. This is just regularly black. As you can see here. And it's the same for the second LP. And then let's see this second one open here. Ooh. All right. And this is the one that I actually got from Target that I was surprised that they had Wu Tang, Wu Tang Forever, Wu Tang Clans, Wu Tang Forever. I was actually shocked that Target, Target had this. Um, my local record store didn't have it, uh, Tower Records didn't have it, so I was just trying to find it somewhere else and just Googled it and it came right up for Target. And it was actually less than $40. I was a bit surprised about that as well. I don't know if any of you guys may know, but Target does have some really good deals on some records there. You'd be surprised by what they actually do have. And so, as you see here on the back is the track listing for the album here. Now, I believe when this came out, it was a double album here. Um, it looks like this is still the same because it comes with four LPs. So, oh wow. And it comes with a poster, a little poster here, as well as thank yous and credits and track listing on the back as well. And I think this one, this one came with a digital download. Oh, that's cool. Okay, that's what's up. Although I kind of already had it, but it's totally fine. But I believe these are just regular black LPs as well. Um, Let's see here. So this is side two. And then, yep, it just looks like it's just regular black. Side one. These things have been coming in kind of reverse lately. So side three. And side four. I hope I didn't crack anything. Right. Okay, we're good. So we got side five and side six. And here is side seven. as well as side eight. We got that there. And then last but not least, I also got this one right here. Roots by Curtis Mayfield. Um, this was an interesting one because I was looking for his first album, but wasn't able to find it. So I was just like, you know what? I saw this here when I Googled it, uh, when I was Googling Chris Mayfield albums, and Target happened to have this one, so I went on ahead and ordered it. And let's go ahead and get this one open. Now, I believe this one is actually colored. Uh, it's part of a series. I think they're re-releasing uh, re a lot of uh, Warner Brothers soul albums from back in the 70s. Because uh, my Superfly that I got uh, came color. It was red. And I think this one says that it's going to be orange. So let's see here. Oh, wow. This is a little bit different. 
Oh wow. Comes with the lyrics here on the inside. As well as the calendar. Now that I was not expecting. And it looks like a calendar for 1971 and 72. And see there on the back is a track listing for the album. And there's the front cover. And let's see what we got here. Oh, yep. It is orange. I'm not sure if you guys might be able to tell that that might be orange, but uh, as you can see, it is orange on both sides. Alright, and that concludes my uh, my video for today the unboxing my random unboxing i plan on doing more like this as well uh because i've subscribed to the vitamin me please club and i definitely have some records that are going to be coming in the future so um thank you guys for watching and thank you for subscribing if you're not subscribed hit that link uh the subscribe button there and i really appreciate you guys checking out my videos and just stay tuned for more and i'm going to be putting my my social media handles in my uh, bios as well. And you guys can follow me on Twitter or on Instagram there. I do post a lot of my records on Instagram as well. So you guys can see my collection. Um, that's going to be about it. And I'll see you guys later. Thank you for watching.